Hello everybody and this is the first video in the series of creating interactive reports. The first step to create a report is specify the query for the particular report and, and I have already started creating my report and in the query panel uh, I'll be selecting all the objects. I have actually selected the eFashion universe which is default uh, universe that's provided with the installation so I'll go ahead and select all the objects that I'll be needing for my report in the stores I want the state and the city I'll also select the store name products I will select the lines and the categories from this one and measures I'll select the whole folder I'll create two prompts one for the year and one for the state and uh, I'll make them both as prompts. I want the users to select only from the list of values and I want to specify a default value. I'll drag in the state and now you see there's an AND here. That means that there is an AND between these two filters in here and when we click on it it will become an R but for our requirements we want it to be an AND so I'll let it be an AND for now set default values for the state I'll select California click on OK and uh, OK here we can refresh and preview data or we can run the query and see the results. In. When you run the query and answer the prompts, this is where, what you will see. A report with all the objects that we selected in our query panel. I'll go ahead and delete this table and then click on the available objects pane in the left so that I can see all the available pro objects and I can drag in the objects that I want to display in my report.